The materials needed are six dropper bottles of simulated blood, a bottle of anti-A serum, and a dropper bottle of anti-B serum, and six glass slides. Label the glass slides according to each corresponding names. Add one drop of each person's simulated blood on the appropriate slides as labeled by the glass slides. To one of the two slides for each person, add one drop of the anti-A serum, which is blue, to the blood. Repeat the process for every slide, adding the blue dropper to every blood. Next, to the second slide, for the same person, add one drop of the anti-B serum, which is yellow, to the blood. Repeat for every glass slide. Finally, you would wait 30 seconds, and you would mix everything with different toothpicks so the results would not be affected. Then you would check for agglutination, which is blood clumping, and you would use the results to find out the blood types of the following people. Last step is to record your results. The next four are examples of blood types. This one is blood type AB. This is blood type A because of the agglutination in the A placement. This is blood type O because there is no agglutination in neither A or B. And finally, this is blood type B because of the agglutination in only B.